Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how you are going to load your sample inside the microscope. Uh, as you already know, we have different kind of SCM stops and sample holder. You need to pick the one based on your analysis and then mount your sample on it by using a copper or uh, carbon tape which they are very conductive tape. So we use conductive tape to mount your sample on the SCM stops. After you do that and make sure your sample ready, I encourage you to watch the slides for sample preparation to make sure you are preparing your uh, sample right. 20% of the analysis is based on preparing the right uh, and accurate sample. So we have these sample holders. We have two of these here right now. Uh, the big side should face down and the smaller side should face up. So as you can see, this is the big side, big face. It's facing down and the smaller face is facing up. We have screws and knobs that you can make a stand for your sample holders. After that, you can just simply screw this into your stand based on the sample holder that you choose. On, the, on this uh, training session, I'm trying to use a multiple sample holder. And then I mount it with the screws and the knobs and fix it to the sample holder. Next, I need to make sure the height it's not above the desired height that you prepare your sample. So make this, prepare your sample, put it on the uh, stage. Then you can use a screwdriver or a key to screw the screw next to each sample to fix that sample to the stop. After that, you can check the height and make sure you are not exceeding this limit for the height. Otherwise, you will hit the gun. Make sure any part of your sample is below this height. Okay. Another thing that you need to consider it's your screw is not coming out from the other side of your stage. So make sure always the other side, the screw is not coming out. If the screw is coming out, then it will stick inside the microscope and you're not able to take it out. So make sure the screw is not coming out from the other side. Then you are ready to load the sample inside the microscope. How to load the sample inside the microscope? Starts from here. On the SCM software, in the stage tab, make sure you are on exchange position. Exchange position is the location of the sample holder that can reach by this rod. Now we are on exchange position. The exchange light is solid green. Now I can use the lock box. How to use the lock box? You put air inside this small chamber right now it's vacuum I'm gonna open it so I put air inside okay air is solid now I can open the door and you can see this rod by pushing it forward I can see the other side you see that thing in the middle is turning while I'm turning this here, there is two positions. One is unlock, the other one is lock. Now, by putting this on unlock position, open the door, I can pull in this inside. See, it's all the way inside. And then lock it here. Now the sample is fixed over here. Whatever you put like this orientation, this, this way inside, you will see it like this side on the screen. Okay, pull it back, close the door, evacuate the chamber. So now we are evacuating this chamber. Now, if we look from here, there is a door which access us to the main chamber. Right now that door is closed. I'm waiting for the evac button to become solid. I have here that beep sound, it's solid. 
Now I can open that door by pushing the door button. So, I uh, should hear a beep sound and then the door should come open. Here we go. The door is open. That is solid yellow. Now I can push it all the way in. Unlock it and pull back the rod. As you can see the sample right now stay in. Now I can close the door. The door is closed. Now on the screen I can push the home button and then the sample starts and come exactly on the center of the screen. That's how you load your sample into the microscope.